Woods of the Dead? Impossible. No one ever comes back from the Woods of the Dead. You don't know Maxine, Naomi. Humph. So what can we do for you? Have you heard or seen a machine at the edge of Crumble Town? Ah, uh, yes. From what could find in the files I believe it's some sort of growing and shrinking machine. I'm taking this fusion cell with us. We cannot let Scoundrel, or any other scavenger get their hands on it. I agree. Where is the power cell? Sir, the tread patterns match the vehicle driven by former Marine Captain Maxine Scarlet. That woman. She took it. You go this way, and I'll go that way. Right. Careful, sis. Thank yous. Sis, check this out. What is it, brother? Come check this out. You're not my brother. Where is he? Where is my brother? I am afraid your brother could not make it. Why you, you? You tricked me, you overgrown furry mongrel of software. Come quietly, miss, and you will not be harmed. Get stuffed, you, fluffy tin can. Sis? Sister? Rain? Dog on it. This is why I don't like separating. Rain. Diane? She's ready. Please help yourself whenever you feel like coming down. You make such good tea, Diane. Thanks. So, anything on your mind, Maxine? No, nothing. Well, there is this one thing. I am the last of the 83rd War Dogs. The others either died or gone Looney Tunes. And I've killed in the war. And I've killed afterwards. I actually find that a part of me enjoys it. The thought terrifies me that I could be coming one of them, the crazies. That can never happen. Not as long as you have Christ in me. Not as long as you don't let your heart be hardened. For sometimes a little suffering is good for the soul. Tea and sugar featuring Maranesia, bring me the light. 
Now for the news. Early this morning former actress and singer Rainy Sydney, now Ranger Rain, has been reported to be missing. She was last seen in Crumble Town with her brother, Ranger Ray. Upon asking Ranger Ray about the disappearance of his sister, he had this to say. Look just keep your ruddy noses out of this, you wankers. I can take care of this on my own. The whereabouts of Ranger Rain are yet unknown. But it is believed she may still be in Crumble Town. Ranger Rain missing? Oh no, Maxine please we must help find her. She is my friend, and I am also one of her biggest fans. Well, then why are we standing here like statues for? Let's go. Yes. Thank you. Car ride. Aurora, Oscar, car ride come on car ride. Neural interface online. You do know there's a trail that goes down the mountain. Yes, but this is much faster. Besides where's the fun in that? All systems functioning. Hurrah baby. Jarhead. She'll be coming down the mountain when she comes. See anything? Nope, nothing. Wait, it's Diane and Maxine in the red guinea pig. Diane and Maxine. I knew they'd be on the search, just as I suspected. Quick, let's change course and follow them. If anyone can find Ranger Rain, it's a former law enforcer right, and marine. And two mutant dogs. Come Diane, we're riding like the wind. How pathetic. I hope she hasn't been much of pest to you, Remy. She has made five attempts to deactivate me and twelve attempts to escape, sir. Hmm, such spirit. Got to love the Australians for that. Why are you doing this to me? What do you want from me? Just where the freak am I anyways? 
This isn't about me, is it? It's who you want. Your comrade, your sister in arms, former Captain Maxine Scarlet. The Gar, she took something from me, and I want it back. Now. You're after the power cell. She doesn't have it anymore. Told me herself she did. She didn't need it. So, she ditched in a place where hopefully a numpty bush ranger like you can't get it. If my dog had a face like yours, I'd shave its ass and teach it to walk backwards. <laughs> Why would you even want that anyway? You must have plenty in store. Cold fusion power cells are unstable and becoming harder to find. So please do tell me where it is. Cock it, you freak wit. Very well then Bubba can take watch then. Apparently, he's a fan of yours and hasn't stopped asking me to take guard of the basement. Wait. Fine, you want to know where it is? You really want to know? I'll tell you because you'll never get your slimy hands on it. It's in a place of untold danger. The woods of the dead. You are never going to see that bloody power cell. Never. They say no one ever comes back from the woods of the dead. But that's not entirely true, is it? Well, okay me and my brother ventured through it, for the kicks of it. But I don't recommend it. They are dangers there that defy all concepts of reality. They did analysis on the vegetation there. It had traces of animal DNA. That's not possible, plant cells and animal cells are not supposed to mix. Please I beg of you scoundrel, colonel, sir, don't go into the woods of the dead. I think we've overextended our courtesy. Lock her in the cell, Remy. Yes, sir. No, no, no. Please, Colonel, will you just listen to me? Don't go into the woods of the dead. Please, you must listen. Don't go into the woods of the dead. Please don't go into the woods of the dead, Colonel. Great ruddy things broken. Hi Maxine, Diane. Please come in. Now let's just get straight to the point I know precisely why you are here. And with all respect I don't need your help. I can handle this on my own. That bloody host, DJ, whatever, can't keep his ruddy nose out of other people's businesses. But she's my friend too. Please don't push us away, we want to help. Look whatever you need, whatever you want. I'm here for you. We're here for you. You don't understand, ever since we were kids living in the bush. We always had each other's backs. I told her to separate, if I hadn't done that. She would have been here right now. But you don't know that. Sometimes there's just no way of knowing what the actions are going to be from your decisions. I'm certain she's alive and well. Oh, I know she's alive. It's the well part I'm worried about. The thought of what they may be doing to her makes me want to chunder. No, I'm certain of my decision. She would still be here. Hey, wake up, Ranger Ray. You sister is missing and you're having a pity party right now. Now, I too had to make some tough decisions. People died and got hurt over those decisions. Now, I honestly wish I could turn back the clock, but I can't. And I sure as heck ain't going to have a pity party over it. So, with or without you Ranger Ray, I'm going to find her. By God I'm going to find her. I suppose the company would be nice. Well, I'll wait for you two by the cruiser. Thank you. What? Oh, nothing. I just found out where the ranger struck his arrow. Oh, don't start with me. Come along girlfriend, the love boat's waiting.
Oh, look it's the steampunks, Charlie and Charles. And Bubba. It's Bubba. What's he doing here? Let's get him. Maxine, baby. Hey, wait minute what you doing? Hey, hey, easy with that baby. No, don't you point that cursed bow tie at me. Hey, Maxine, Diane, Ranger Ray. Charlie, Charles. Hey, now, baby, get that bow tie away from me. What's the matter, afraid of a little bow tie? I always thought bow ties were cool. Does someone have a little bow tie phobia? I'm more afraid of what's behind it. Baby, please. We found him just standing here. Says he has a message. That's right, I do, I do, I do. From Scoundrel himself. Let's have it then, Bubba. And please stop calling me baby. Squeal pig. He wants to trade Ranger Rain for you, ba uh, Maxine. You will meet him on Madison Street. In two hours. And you will come alone. Are you blooming mental? What kind of deal is that? For your sake, you have better not have laid so much as a finger on my sister. Or I'll have your bottom on a platter. The boss wouldn't even let me near her. I swear, pinky promise. Pinky promise. How about I break your pinky off and kick it all over the ground? Maxine, I do not like how this sounds. It smells of a trap, Maxine. Yes, please don't go, Maxine. Tell you what. How about we trade this numpty for rain instead? I think not. Coward. Well, now a flying pig. Kinda reminds me of the Baron from Dune. Bring in that, that floating, floating fat, fat man, man the Baron. The Baron. <laughs> Gee, I never thought you a geek, Maxine. Thank you. So now what do we do? We're going to give them just what they want. Well, it was worth a try, sir. Patience, Bubba. She will come. You seem so assured of this ruddy and witted plan of yours. I know Captain Scarlet. I trained her, mentor her, I can read her like a book. Yeah, sure you do. Ah, Captain Maxine Scarlet, the Gar, my sister-in-arms. At last, I knew you would come. I just knew you would. Maxine, what are you doing here? You shouldn't have come. Don't you worry about a thing, Ranger Rain. I'll have this mess picked up in no time. Is that a screen on your visor? What is that? Oh no, not again. Brother. Sister. Armor integrity at 98%. Maxine, I'm so sorry he came right up behind me. It's most humiliating a bear being taken by a bear. You didn't think I would expect you to come along, did you? You alright, Diane? He stunned my dogs. Dropped your weapons, all of you. Now. Where's the steampunks? They were supposed to me us. I don't know. I mean it, drop your weapons. Drop them or she dies. Remy set your cannon to kill. Yes, sir.
Done, sir. Do as he says. We'll have to find another way out. Good, good, very good. Now then take us to the woods of the dead. I'm so sorry, Maxine. I didn't think he was naughty enough to do it. Don't judge yourself too harshly, Rain. Very well, Colonel. I'll take you to that dang power cell. But mark my word, sir, you will regret this. We shall see, Captain. We shall see. Tell myself to be 